Here we have a problem. It says Lisa took half hour taking her boat going downstream, but it uh, upstream. But if it only take her quarter hour to going upstream, we're asked to find what the speed of a boat and current. So let's take a look at how we're gonna draw a picture of this. Okay, so I have a five miles. If she goes downstream, her speed would be five divided by boat speed plus the current speed. This is fast. Okay, so downstream she's going to go fast. And for this one, she only took quarter hours. Okay. Now let's see what happens when she goes to upstream. Okay, same distance, five miles. But this time she's going to go a lot slower because her speed is going to be slower now. Okay, this is slow and it's upstream. This time she took half hour. Okay. We have two equations, two unknowns. So let's write our equation over here. We'll have a quarter equal to five B plus C. That's one of them. And then we have half equal to five B minus C. Okay. I don't know about you, I do not like those equations that have fractions. So what I teach my students is you draw a butterfly. This is how you get out of the fractions. Okay, let's draw it out of here a little bit more. So the half is equal to 5b minus c. So it's a fraction. And what we're going to do is we're going to draw a butterfly, looks like this, and change this one into a 1 times b minus c is equal to 5 times 2, which is 10. Okay, Much prettier equation. Let's do the same thing for the other one. So here we have b plus c is equal to 20. Okay. If you add those two equations, add over here, you have 2b is equal to 30. Obviously, b equal to 15. So that's the boat speed. Okay. If you subtract those two, you have um, b, so you have 2c equal to 10. So c is equal to 5. That's your current speed. So the boat is 15 miles per hour and the current is 5 miles per hour. Right? Hope this helps. Have a confident day.